Most major cancers have a certain color associated with them. Lung cancer has had a little trouble finding what color is associated with it, but uh, white has become the color. You know, lung cancer kills more patients than breast cancer, colon cancer, and prostate cancer combined, but it doesn't get the same attention. The White Ribbon Project is about changing the public perception about lung cancer. Not everybody thinks that they can get lung cancer. I mean, I never smoked a day in my life, and it's not something that I would have ever imagined that I could get. In October of 2020, I became very frustrated that we really weren't getting any responses from our cancer centers across the country about what they were going to do for Lung Cancer Awareness Month. I asked my husband if he could please make me a big white ribbon made out of wood that I could just put on our front door and I could scream that I have lung cancer, someone in this house has lung cancer, and I'm not ashamed of this. She came to me somewhat tearful. The irony is I'm a physician and I, I, I couldn't help her, but this gave me some way to, to help her. We put a picture of that on a private Facebook page for lung cancer survivors in Colorado. And what I got back was, well, we like what you did. Would your husband make one for us? Patients see that, advocates see that, they want one, and it's attracting attention to a cancer that's really a silent killer. St. Elizabeth taking this monumental step to host a ribbon building event in support of the White Ribbon Project and the lung cancer community, it's, it's transformative. To have a hospital system stand up with you, the medical community, it validates the importance of progress for lung cancer. Getting the support of cancer centers, of clinicians, of researchers, of nurses, is going to just do wonders to improve the detection, treatment, and further research for, for lung cancer. I want people to know that there is hope. There is hope for long-term survival, even with a late-stage diagnosis. I'm Heidi Neff Mananda, and I'm here today because anyone with lungs can get lung cancer.